Well, feeding time for Reg and Jules. Jules looks keen. Oh. Right, I felt a bit guilty last week, because last week I gave Jon Snow a, a whole big roach. And all he's got was the bit left over in a tiny roach. So today, you look keen. Today I'm going to give them a big roach. Or a biggest roach. I've got a small roach as well, but I hope that could well be for one eye upstairs. We don't see how it goes. <clears throat> But um, I've got a feeling I might give it to Jaws first, that big roach. Because she looks keen. I might regret this decision. Do you want a big roach? Hey? Do you want a big roach? You're looking at it. Or biggish roach. I wouldn't say it's a big roach, but you can take it out of my hand. Or are you more keen on getting in with Reg? Is that what it is? Try to let go of it. You gonna come and get it? Or shall I let go? I think I'm gonna have to let go. I thought she might have come and got with it then. Because she looked really keen. Go guppy, go. Bits galore for you. Oh, she just downed it in one. Can't believe that. Half of that was supposed to be for Reg, or well, not half. I was expecting like a third left. Oh no, Reg. Reg, the big roach is gone, mate. I should have given it you first, shouldn't I? I didn't think she was going to swallow it down in one go. Oh, you big. Well, there you go. I'm gonna have to give this to um, give this little roach to um, Reg. Oh, I don't start floating again. Where'd that go? It's floating, Reg. Got to try and get my hand on it. <laughs> Give it a squeeze. Squeeze all the bloody air out of it. You ain't gonna take it out of my hand, are you? I've got my hand in there now. Ah. Never used to have this problem with sprats, because you used to freeze them. I don't know, I don't know. Never had this problem with sprats, I don't know. Oh, it's getting better. I'm squeezing it like crazy. Good sake. Ah. Oh, she's doing my head in. Well, that's interesting. I squeezed it like crazy and I finally got it to sink but what came out of it was that progress that swim bladder that was inside that's the swim bladder isn't it but it's full of air there you go that's what's making it float. Like a little balloon. Well, it's sunk now. And I've scared the crap out of Reg, so I'm sure you'll come and get it in a bit. Well, it's sunk anyway. 
Well, that was interesting. Swim, swim bladder, I swear that was. It's like a little balloon. I just put, squeezed it and it popped like a little, like that packaging bubbles you get. I scared um, Reg a bit, messing around, sticking my hand in and everything. Right, tonight, there's bits galore and even more now. Tonight I won't feed the guppy, because there's bits galore in there. But he's sunk anyway. I'm going to have to just leave it there and I'm sure Reg will come and get it in a bit. When he's chilled out a bit, I freaked him out a bit. It's unusual really. I'm not normally bothered by all that, messing around. Um, the other week I was talking about um, a good Facebook page called Piranha Central. And there's another one I've been I, I've been looking at for, for, for a year. Over, wow, nearly two years I think. There's another one I, I, I look at as well on uh, Facebook called Piranhas Only. So I'll put a link to that one as well down in the description. Along with my Patreon page. Um, that's a good um, Facebook page to check out. Learn all about piranha and people's experiences and so on. So I'll put that link below to the Piranhas Only on Facebook. And they get stuck into this. I shall have to sit here and wait until Reg recovers. Well, I got so busy doing things in life. I forgot about that fish on the floor with Reg. He's obviously come and got it. Because it's gone. Don't know what's up. I've, I've spooked him out quite a bit. Messing about with that. Um, squeezing that fish. That was weird, that swim bladder. I am sure it was a swim bladder. Popped it like a balloon. Here we go. At least he's had, I know he's had a ro little roach anyway. 